is Sims, and we are back with more of the Sims 4 house rules, which is our Harry Potter Legacy Challenge, and I- j What the fuck are you doing up here? Teleport here. Okay, there you go. Um, yeah, that's not Toddler's Dump. I just hit the record button, and I was like, okay, so kids age- And then I was like, oh, 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 what is- I hi, huh, what? Um, okay. So, Scorpius- and Salazar aged up. Modify household and Cass. Why can I not remember which one's which? Salazar is the redheaded one. I don't know why, because I think Scorpius and Salazar, even though it's Salazar and Scorpius, that's the way they were born. But my brain just like switches, and I don't know, so I get confused. So, anyway, yeah, right. He grew up to be a child of the islands. Okay, sure, whatever. It's fine. Um, Did I give you more than one outfit? No, we only have our one little outfit. Here we go. Look at our snazzy little of it, because he was our little glasses coon, so he's got his glasses back. And I'm not necessarily sure that's exactly the eye, the speckly eye that he had, because sometimes, for some reason, when they age up to toddlers, they have them, and then when they age up to children, they don't have it anymore. So it's like, I don't understand, game. Keep it consistent, but I knew he had, like, brown, oh no, he had the green speckled. And there are red eyes, so, like, I just kind of went with, like, the tone, right? And I might have changed his red eye from being as bright to a little bit more muted just to kind of match tone-wise eyes. But anyway, here's our adorable little Salazar. Okay. And then there we go. Here's his little formal wear. We have his athletic wear, which we'll never see because, you know, kids don't wear the athletic. His sleepy wear. His party wear. He's our little posh kid, you know what I mean? He's kind of like wearing a little bit like he's a little bit like snazzier. That's the way he was. You know, snazzy. And then we have Scorpius. Don't look at his outfit. Don't look at it! Anyway, he's a green fiend, so... The <laughs> Child of the ocean. I want to save the oceans. I want to like... Like, I need so much green. Like, there's like such fucking hippies. <laughs> Like, oh my god. Alright. Yeah, I did. I gave him, like, longer hair. Like, a little bun hair. Because, like, look, we don't have a lot of hair for kids. And sometimes, like, I don't know what to do. So this is what he's got. So anyway. And he was more, like, the cool, like, relaxed kid. So, you know. And he had his browns. But, so I did the best I could with the brown, you know, again. Although, I worry about his chin when he ages up. I really do. Because, like, you know, that bottom lip is, like, Taking up all the chin space, but anyway. So there we go. That's our Scorpius. His athletic outfit. Those look like dress pants, but like whatever, don't mind it. They're I, I don't know what I was thinking, but it's okay. We're never gonna see it, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> I guess. I'll... <laughs> do, do, do. He's wearing his hot weather outfit now. There you go. And obviously little Jasper is still just little Jasper. Which, are you going to age up soon? Oh, you have like a brown with blue speckles. I'm sorry, I just went dead silent for a minute. When do, when does Jasper age up? Not in this part. Nope, we won't get to it this part. <laughs> yeah, oh, let's talk like a pirate day. You should talk like a pirate with your brother. Daruna. Sing about talk like a pirate day. Of us, their villain. That's a rude introduction. I don't want that. Oh, hi, Mimiti. Share them secrets. Wait. So I guess you already know what's his face. 
It's going to be kind of funny that, like, one of them is going to marry... It could be Jasper, too. I don't know. Anyway. Somebody's going to marry his, like, descendant, and they're going to be like, Oh, my God! Like, wait! You're, like, grandfather or whoever's... Your ancestor's ghosts live in my house! Maybe that's how Claude the Second finds us. You know what I mean? What are you doing? What the fuck? I was trying to do, like, more. Why can't I find, like, more choices? There's no, like, more choices. Okay, what are you doing? You don't care about talk like a pirate day. You're sleeping? Really? And you need to take a bath. Actually, why don't you... Free the salty brain! There you go, sweetie! No, you were supposed to, like, use the head. There you go. Use the head. And swab the dick! And then swab that deck. We should do a seance circle. Hmm. And then can you just... We could also have you cook grub, because, you know, that'll give us... Let's uh, make... What can we make? Let's make a taco casserole. We don't need to, like, do any of that, but, like... <gasps> Look at your cute little outfit. I love it. Huh. Look at you. You're so snazzy. You're so snazzy. No wonder why your kids have are like are like fashion gurus. Look at you. Doesn't quite match. Like the colors aren't exactly perfect, but they blend. Hey, That's all that matters. Huh? <laughs> yes. Aww. More choices. Friendly. Hey. No. You don't get to shriek. You're a mean bird. You're very mean. You bit me hard. You can stay in your cage. He put himself in his cage because I yelled at him. And I was like, no, you're a bad bird. You're mean. And I pushed him away from him. I was like, no, go away. I don't want you near me. You're going to be nasty and bite me like that. So then he put himself in his cage as punishment. Yeah, you know. You know he's a bad bird. He's a bad boy. Ah. It's like, I'm going to go play. That's fine. I don't give a shit what you do. <laughs> That's like an asshole. I don't give a shit what you do, but I don't. Like, he can do whatever the fuck he wants. Like, I give a shit within reason, but like, you want to flirt and make out? Oh, well, we can flirt while we're doing here. More choices. Romance. Oh, well, wait. Admire pirate booty. I just sometimes <laughs> ask to rock boat. I swear there was something else here that was quite share your dock. Oh, that's share the burden or whatever, right? That just concerned the fuck out of me. I was like, something about docking? What? Like, oh god damn, inappropriate. Toddler's fine. How about you? What are you doing? Hmm. I'm um, just trying to see what you could do that might be like. Hmm. You could go pee when you're done playing. That'll be fine. Share talk like a pirate day excitement. I'm just trying to like get the. I like. Oh, then you need to take a shower when you're done drinking. That's why you went to go drink. Take a long shower. There you go. Look, everyone's up here except for this kiddo. Oh, wait, did you just get it? Oh, and you did too, because I used the head. So good, everyone's talk like a pirate day is great. Good. We could still do talk like a pirate day things, I just, you know. Are you still hungry? Yeah, you should grab a serving. That looks so good. 
Mm. The food in this game is... I'm actually a little bit hungry. James the Dolphin. Turinga. Where's he going? He's going to go play. That's fine. So we need to go when you are done here. Oh, that's what we should do. Can we... <gasps> Can we do a circle here? Create a... Oh, no. Let's do it here. Create a seance circle. Let's do this shit. I don't know what... I want to do this because we've never done this. What? Stop it. No shrieking. I don't want to hear it. You're a mean bird. You bit me and that wasn't nice. Uh, perform a ceremony? Cool. We can do that without like... Cool. It's not sitting at the table. That's neat. Ooh, it's glowing! Alba! Bura! Leave your body oh. behind. <laughs> Summon the dead a lot. Results may vary. Summon Bone Hilda. Whoops. Send spiritual fertility. And then invoke the dead. Why not? Why not? Let's try it. Let's see what happens. Oh, speaking of. Okay, so you're fine. Wait, who's you? That's Snack Daddy. And Akira's good, and this should be Yus yeah, Yusuke's good. Morgana's good. Galileo's good. Gilderoy is good. Morgan's good. Can't wait to see you. I miss you, Morgan. There's a freaking crap. Alba. Keep looking for it. And you want to start a club gathering. I mean, we could do that. What club are we part of? Let's see. You're part of House Rules, so that's you. Okay, so Godric, Makoto, and Rowena. Dokesta. That's basically it, right? Because everybody else is kind of dead. Hold on. I mean, Snack Daddy and like... I mean, like, we have like people way the fuck up here, but like everybody else is kind of like... Well, actually, no. Haru and stuff might... No. Oh, Noir's dead. Fox and Haru and stuff are still around. Okay. But you're only part of this group, so... Start gathering. Just invite everyone over. Get M Godric and Makoto and stuff here. Hello, Buck. Oz Buk Mirane. Creepum. Dokesta. Why don't you come over here and try to console? Oh, she's pregnant and naked because we must have gotten rid of whatever she was wearing. So, uh, okay. So she's just, look. If the girl. Pregnancy. We're having a girl with Makoto Kimura. Makoto, not Nikoto. <laughs> I might have spelled Makoto's name wrong. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But. I think it is supposed to be M.A., isn't it? Uh, look. What? Makoto, what are you wearing? What are you wearing? I did not give you that outfit. Sweet cheeks, baby, honey, girlfriend, no. Okay. It is hot, so let's put on your hot weather outfit. There you go. You look much better now. Can we put on your hot weather outfit? I got rid of a lot of my female... Sim clothes. Oh, she's is wearing her hot weather outfit. Her hot weather outfit is missing. Oh. Can you just put on your swimwear? There you go. I mean, you got to just pretend that you were in your swimwear anyway. Ahoy, me matey. Introduce yourselves to your aunts and uncles. You could do that too. Crazy. You know. Wait, what, 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 what do we say? Spectres are friendly! Yay! Finally! Hey, Bone Hilda, what's up, girl? Worshipping Bone Hilda! 
We worship at the altar that is Bonehilda. I do miss her coffin and having her come out all the time, but I mean, sure, I guess. I just need a couple pictures of that because it's amazing. Why are you pissed? What's wrong with you? Listen to me! Why are my toddlers fussy later? lately? He's an asshole. Hug. Talk. You could come down here and, uh... Oh, you are down here. Cool. Brighten day. Check on him. Make funny faces. Did you meet all your aunts and uncles or you're out here chatting with your uncles? That's cute. Cool, he's chatting. Joke about weird animals. What are you doing? Talk about toys. Compliment. Ahoy, me matey. I guess you didn't introduce yourself like I told you to. That's okay. Oh, 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 Gilderoy's pissed. That's because we invoked the dead. We invoked the dead! Well, how do we not know Gilderoy? Again, we don't know. I mean, I get he's an ancestor, but I kind of feel like Sims should just... I've been saying this all week. I feel like Sims should know their relatives, and we shouldn't have to introduce ourselves to our relatives. Even if it's ancestral ghosts. Like, I feel like you should be able to be like... I kind of understand introducing yourself to your ancestors if they're dead. I guess. But I also kind of feel like if you're living on the lot and the ghosts are living... That because The Sims has ghosts, that, like, you should kind of already know them and you shouldn't have to introduce yourself. I'm like this. You know how, like, see how that relationship bar is so little? That's the way it should automatically be. She comes up like, oh, hey, I can now talk to them. I'm having to be like, oh, let me introduce myself. <laughs> Get to know. Ahoy. He's gonna go play. Alright. So they're all chatting. You're just chilling here. We keep missing all the festivals. <laughs> once you've gone to them like once or twice, they're not exciting anymore. <laughs> like, they're really not. It's like, uh The children's festival's cute if you like bring every single fucking person related to your goddamn sins because like for example if we went to the festival of youth right now and Kingsley and Oliver went with Salazar, Scorpius and Jesper and blessed all of the kids then we would bring them here they would be so fucking livid because every single ghost in this house didn't bless them they'd be pissed at Gilderoy forever because Gilderoy didn't bless them at the festival of youth despite the fact that he wasn't there but because he's in this house, and I swear to God, it's fucking ridiculous. It's so annoying. He's like, Gilderoy's like, hey, these are all my descendants. Gilderoy, didn't you wear glasses? Why are you not wearing glasses as a ghost? I'm pretty sure you wore glasses. I mean, yes, hello. Gilderoy. Glasses. Why are you not wearing glasses, Gilderoy? Wait, Severo wore glasses. And Gilderoy wore glasses. And Galileo wore glasses. And Morgana wore glasses. And Kingsley does not wear glasses! <laughs> we had a trend! It should have been Makoto. It should have been Makoto! No, it's okay. I like... I like... I like Kingsley. But I'm just saying, Makoto was the glasses wearer in this house. Holy shit, we fucked this up so bad. We fucked it up so bad. I don't think Gibson wore glasses. I can't quite remember. I don't think he did. Minerva wore a monocle. Or was that a vein? Ship Noy. No, I think a vein was the one with the monocle. If it was a vein, was the monocle. Wait a minute. You know, we should be able to look in this. Hold on. Let's look in our family tree. Yeah, no, a vein was the one with the monocle. You can't see it in her thing, but like. Oh, nope. Minerva actually worked. No, every. Oh my god! 
Kingsley's the only one who has some more glasses. What the fuck? <laughs> I did not know that was a thing. Like, look, I know how my Sims, a lot of them wear glasses. I like glasses. I don't know. But I, oh my God, Gibson had glasses. She had like the tiny little like spectacle kind of thing. She had a monocle. You can't see it in this. She might have only worn it in her like dark form. I, but I know that she did. Oh my god. Gilderoy, I know, wore glasses, but he's not wearing them in this outfit, which is weird. And then Galileo wore glasses. Morgana wore glasses. <laughs> you were the only one who hasn't worn glasses. Oh, he failed so bad. <laughs> Uh, oh my god you are yeah, such a failure he's like i wear contacts it's fine i mean by default then you have like salazar has to be our heir because like he wears glasses like. so do we have somebody around that could uh change diaper toddler care change diaper does he need a bath he's tired let's go change his diaper okay cool come on he's like i don't want a diaper change you're such a pain in my ass he's like god damn it yeah sure okay why not? Whatever. <laughs> and then you bunk down. It's like weird having the stairs here because everybody walks into the top. Like, look! Look! This house is fucking weird, okay? Could you imagine this on any home show? They'd be like, what the fuck is this? In my kid's room? Like... Tuck him in. All right, we can also end the gathering. Let our siblings go home because they're probably getting tired. Let the triplets. Oh my God, Makoto. I know we loved Kingsley and everything, but you at least wore glasses. See, that's why I was leaning toward you originally. It was like, um, you have glasses. I'm not. I don't begrudge picking Kingsley. I really do love Kingsley, but we can end the gathering. Wait. Oliver got invited to house to go. Got invited to Phantom Thieves, not you. <laughs> Tony, Ryuji, Haru, and Fox, and then Oliver. Like, but what's what's the original house? Oh, Regulus is in that. Okay, so the original house rules should actually... Well, that's why there's house rules, too. With Godric, Makoto, and Rowena. Because we couldn't fit everybody, and then our kids will go in one or the other. Like... Like, Regulus is the only person still alive. I mean, again, not true, because Vane's still alive. Legend's still alive. Because they're vampires, so they're going to stay around forever. But everyone else is pretty much dead. Just three of them, I think, right? Right? I'm going to keep having to check this. I was like, I can't remember. I mean, like, PT3, but, like, whatever. Yes, so Legend... Evane and Regulus are the only ones really alive. And then, like, well, these kids are, like, they might die, and who knows about any of them over here. But, like, Jesus Christ. Like, look at this. Look at this shit. Look at what we've done here. It's like, oh, this is our family tree. Okay, yeah, well, oh, my. Well, actually, if we just go here, because it all stems from her. Legend's got some other kids over here, but, like, it all kind of stems here, and it's like, holy fucking shit. Woo! And there would have been more, but... You can just not. They can just go home.
Who's Alec Oliver? Rowena just had a baby. Okay. Yeah, but hey, I know that, but Stacy is. Oh, Stacy is really is uh somebody is um mm -hmm, uh yeah Haru or. Let's go back up here, right? No, wait, 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 wait. no, 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 Gilder, hold on. New no, wait. Oh shit. How are we gonna figure this out? Oh. Oh, Haru might have. Haru's daughter had a baby. Okay, that's what it was. I was like... Because, like, I couldn't remember who was whose kid. Like, Yusuke had... I couldn't remember with Yusuke whose kid... Which ones. But they were houses. Right, and I let them not be because they weren't related to... Um... They... Oh, because I was like, wait, that's Yusuke, but, like... Right, they weren't related to Galileo, so they could be whatever they wanted. So her daughter, but who's Oliver? Who's this Oliver person? It's gotta be somebody else. Oh, wait, who's this? Oh, Alec Oliver. Oh! Oh, Fox has a grandchild now, too. Oh. Okay. Wow. Okay, and we already knew about Krista, so, oh, okay. But, like, poor Noir and Futaba never had kids. That's so sad. Uh, Noir would have made beautiful babies. Anyway. They all had babies. I was like, who the fuck is this Oliver person? Like, not Oliver Oliver, but last name Oliver. <laughs> okay, so you're actually okay. How are the kiddos doing? They're fine. They could stay up for a little bit. Oh, you're gonna get something to eat. Cool. So everyone's going home. Okay, you could... You could go home now. Godric, I think it's time... Okay, there you go. I was like, it's time for you to go home, buddy. Toddler's in bed. Everything seems good. I don't see any specters popping around. We haven't made anything in a while. So actually, why don't you... Knit... Resume your gray socks. Resume those socks while you chat with your child. Okay, who's calling you? Salem wants to come on. No, Salem, it's... Well, it's only 8 p.m., but, like, no. Salem, why are you... Salem, why are you calling my child? Are you friends with my child? I don't think so, Salem. What the fuck? He's just jealous that we kind of took Oliver away from him, but also oh. that Oliver took us away from him. He's like, hello? I heard your family does, like, thruple things. Like, look, this is the first time in a while we've had a normal relationship, okay? First time in a while. Because, like, I wouldn't exactly... Gibson, technically, in the very first... Look at him, he's, like, not even going to lecture his child about being an asshole. Could you clean that up? Oh, fuck you and your nightmares. Go back to bed. Fuck nightmares, go back to bed. Whoa. There you say. go. Anyway, um, what was I saying? Yeah. So Gibson didn't have exactly, cause I'm pretty sure Gibson had children with Everly and King. You know what I mean? So, like, he was like, oh, there we go, talking. So, like, eh, I don't know, you weren't doing too good, honey, having kids with other people. What's this? Moments peace from talking in a toddler. Uncomfy from low quality furniture. Well, that's what you get for sitting with a plant up your ass. It's going to be uncomfortable. So Gibson was kind of right up there. He had two different, he had a baby mama and a baby daddy. And then that kind of, that game un, unfortunately got deleted. So we had to start over. And we just were like, fine, we'll just make Minerva. So she was the only one that lived through that tragic house fire is what we were going with, I guess. And everybody died. Uh... And she 
was in love with one of her friends who married one of her other friends. And then the third friend was always in love with her. And then she was obsessed with like uh, vampires. So he became a vampire and like hid his yes. identity. So that relationship was a little weird. And then their daughter from being trapped inside all the time, married a freaking oh, like gosh. death eater and was like evil and wanted her daughter to be evil, an evil vampire. And Severa was like, fuck that shit. I'm going to go become a spellcaster. And then fell in love with Morgan, who she couldn't be with technically because he wasn't supposed to like have a family. But he had a secret family. And then Gilderoy was just a whore and slept with everybody. He had like kids with everyone, literally. He had alien babies. He had babies with Caleb and Waldo and Colorado. <laughs> like... Just, he had a lot of just random kids with random people. Moochie, peachy, and then stuff. Galileo had a husband sure and a boyfriend okay. who also were boyfriends. Graffini and you know, play. actually, no, that's not true. Morgana and Maruki were normal. Like, Morgana and Maruki had a normal Whoa. relationship. They didn't, and then, like, now Kingsley and Oliver have, and then that's the way the next. So it's like, we kind of went from, like, some weird family dynamics to, like, nah, now we're basic. What you doing? Don't chew my lamp. That was expensive. He's like, not as expensive as me. Oh. Look at that. Keecher trying to get in all up inside of us. What you doing? Bye. <laughs> uh, it's still we've only managed a day because i'm going as fast and i don't see any ghosties out which is good because the spiritual vitality is like finally increased and happy and who what why are you kiddo go to bed go to bed bed what the hell is wrong with you yeah there's not even any green which is fine i'm okay with it why don't you go grab something to eat and then go to bed? Huh? Okay, let's see. You're sleeping in your bed. Okay, you're gonna go to sleep now. I gotta make sure you sleep and not nap. Okay. There goes the lights flickering. Oh, 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 we got a ghost. It's one of ours. Oh, no, it's Ghidri. Never mind. I should have known when I thought it was pink, but... There's nobody else really around. But everybody's asleep. But we can't, like, super speed probably because of Geetry. We'll just kind of, like, poke around and watch him. Where's he going? What's he doing? He's just keeping taps on shit. But Temperance isn't back, which is good. Oh, what's going on over here? Oh. Yusuke's out, and he's pissed. Yusuke is mad. We're scared. Why are we scared? What, 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 what? Why does everybody get scared all of a sudden? Oh, hi. Oh, Temperance. That bitch. Never mind. That bitch is back. Ah. More choices. Friendly. Can we try to calm her down? We can't. Oh, good lord. Oh, good. Look at that. Um. Okay, we can't, like, calm anybody down who's, like, angry. Replace. <sighs> now everyone's awake. Everyone was sleeping, and then Temperance had to come out and scare the bejesus out of everyone. Despite the fact that we were... Look, see? Oh, rude, girl! You scared the shit out of me. Okay, it said that spirits were in a good mood, but they seemed depressed. But that's okay, I guess. We've never gotten the, like, eyeball-y one. Like, we've never gotten the nerd one. And then in this house, I guess, this is how we do things. Chab. <laughs> okay, go eat. Alright, go eat. I know how you feel. I feel hungry myself. You can go eat too. 
scream incoherently at Yusuke. I like that. Do that. I actually go scream incoherently at Yusuke. What the fuck is this? Why is it on fire? Sell oddity to collector. I guess it's a good oddity. Bizarre idol. Paranormal investigator Claude Rene du Plantier Guidry picked up one of these bizarre idols while investigating a haunted museum in the early 1900s. He found. Never mind. Mount mysterious symbols. More choices. Replace. Grab a serving. You can remove creepy doll. <sighs> Friendly introduction. Hey, Morgan! Mop. Talk to cute Dolly! I just want to see this. That's why I didn't delete the freaking uh... Stop, you're fine. Go talk to cute Dolly. I want to see this happen. I've never seen this. No, 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 no. Leave him alone. Put him down. I want him to go talk to the cute Dolly. Leave my toddler alone, goddammit. I've never gotten to see this. It's hard to see because of where she's positioned. It's like everybody else is creeped out by it, but you kind of just want them to not be creepy, you know what I mean? Like, it's hard to see in the angle, though. The spiritual vitality was supposed to be a positive thing, and then fucking Temperance fucked it all up. Temperance destroyed my life. Why can't you get rid of this? Too scared to get near it. Oh, good God. Can you do it? You need to come eat this. Can you go to sleep? Yeah. Remove creepy doll. <laughs> the giggling was really weird. Right when I did that, the giggling. <laughs> Whoa. There is so much fucking shit going on in this house. It's not even funny. I think of the drama music and you're like, what's happening? What's happened? What happened? Where did it go? Oh my god. Everybody is out. Everyone is so fucking angry. Let's just... Uh-huh. I hate using my page up button. What? What the hell's happening? Numlock. Page up. Oh, okay. I was like... I My numlock was... <gasps> Ask other kids if you can join in. God damn it, kid. Okay. Whoa, I didn't mean to be going super speed. Oh, it's because I was trying to page up, but, like, I hit my numlock. My numbers were- God damn it, Yusuke! Stop it! Fucking asshole, I just fixed that shit! I love you, but I swear to God, Yusuke, I will exercise your fucking ghost. I will not. I will absolutely fucking not, but don't tell him. So, like- <laughs> <laughs> uh, haunted houses are fun. <laughs> annoying, but fun. Like, they're annoying when all the ghosts are always angry, but, like, now our ghosts are okay, so we just need to keep doing everything we're doing and, like, why not? But anyway, I'm gonna wrap this part up here. We're not quite at time, but, like, it seems like a good spot as I need to end it, and I need to go get something to eat because I'm fucking starving, so. Anyway, I will see you guys next time. Remember to give the video a big thumbs up. And subscribe to see more.